anyone can be good in the regular season, but you have to be great to succeed in the postseason. These are the top 10 greatest playoff performers in NBA history. Number 10, Larry Bird. Boston Celtics legend Larry Bird boasts some of the most impressive playoff performances in Celtics franchise history. His fierce rivalry with the Lakers star Magic Johnson made for some of the best playoff series in the 1980s. Bird won three titles with the Celtics, who dominated the Eastern Conference playoffs during the 1980s with five conference finals titles during Bird's years in Boston. He was named the finals MVP in both 1984 and 1986 championship season, with his best run coming in 1984 where he averaged 27 points per game, and the Celtics stormed through the playoffs before taking down the Lakers in the finals. Number 9, Shaquille O'Neal. No player has ever dominated the paint quite like Shaq. The most physically punishing and hardest to guard big man in the history of the game was a constant force in the NBA playoffs. Paired with Kobe Bryant, Shaq helped the Lakers to a 3 p between 2000 and 2002, earning the finals MVP honors in all three of those series. In his prime, O'Neal was the best player in basketball. There was no answer for his combination of size and athleticism, and his NBA playoff stats led the league in just about every single category in the 2000s. In 2006, after being traded to the Miami Heat, the Big Diesel would help a young Dwayne Wade to the first championship in franchise history. Number 8, Stephen Curry. Wardell Stephen Curry is the greatest three-point shooter the game has ever seen. Curry won four NBA championships with the Golden State Warriors between 2015 and 2022. During the golden era of the Warriors dynasty, Curry and the Warriors were almost untouchable. Steph's Golden State Warriors would play LeBron James in the Cleveland Cavaliers in four straight finals, where Curry would come out on top, winning three of the four. However, Curry was not rewarded with the finals MVP in any of these series, but in 2022, the Warriors would beat the Boston Celtics in six games in the NBA Finals, and Stephen Curry would finally get his finals MVP. Even though Curry had help from the likes of Clay Thompson, Kevin Durant, and Draymond Green, he still belongs on this list. Number seven, Magic Johnson. Arguably the greatest point guard in NBA history, Magic Johnson dominated the NBA Finals and led the Lakers to an NBA championship five times over the 1980s, including his rookie season where Kareem Abdul-Jabbar would get injured in Game 5 versus the Sixers and had to sit out the deciding Game 6 in Philadelphia. Hurdles like this didn't phase Magic as he started at center and dominated Game 6, winning the Finals MVP in his rookie season. His career just kept on getting better though as Magic would retire with three NBA Finals MVPs and go down as one of the best playoff performers in NBA history. Number 6, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. Kareem Abdul-Jabbar was one of the most dominant players in NBA history, so there's no surprise that he makes this list. Although he won five of the six championships with Magic Johnson, many younger fans don't understand how dominant Kareem was with the Milwaukee Bucks in the 1970s. In 1971, Kareem and the Bucks would sweep the Baltimore Bullets in the NBA Finals in just his second season in the league, taking home the Finals MVP. Kareem holds the record for the widest gap between Finals MVPs as he also won the honor in 1985, which is a 14-season gap. That just proves how dominant Kareem was for such a long period of time. Number five, Kobe Bryant. The Mamba won his first three championships as a younger player alongside Shaquille O'Neal, as together they were one of the greatest duos in NBA history. Kobe would win two more without Shaq in 2009 and 2010, which included a stunning seven-game series against the loaded Boston Celtics. Kobe was a big game performer as he had several incredible postseason moments, such as the double game winner versus the Phoenix Suns in Game 6 of the Western Conference Playoffs, which claimed the series for the Lakers, as well as a tone-setting 40-point performance in Game 1 of the 2009 NBA Finals, which resulted in the Lakers winning the championship that season. Although Kobe wouldn't bring home the Finals MVP in his first three titles, he still makes up for that with 2009 and 2010. Number four, Tim Duncan. The big fundamental was the centerpiece of a talented San Antonio Spurs franchise that won five titles with him in the lineup. Competing in a loaded Western Conference for the most part of his career, Duncan took down superstar teams as one of the best two-way players of his time. He was an all-time rim protector on the defensive end and averaged 20 points per game on the offensive end. Duncan appeared in over 250 playoff games during his 20-year career. In 2003, a prime Duncan almost managed a quadruple double in game six of the NBA Finals against the New Jersey Nets, finishing with 21 points, 20 rebounds, 10 assists, and a crazy eight blocks as the Spurs defeated the Nets. Duncan's five championships and three finals MVP awards make him one of the most successful player performers in league history. Number three, LeBron James. In the early stages of LeBron's career, the King received a lot of criticism for not being there when his team needed him, especially in the 2011 finals versus the Dallas Mavericks. However, after that, LeBron was a different beast in the playoffs. James would win championships in the two years following with the Miami Heat. Then he would win a championship for his hometown, the Cleveland Cavaliers, in a mind-boggling 3-1 comeback against Stephen Curry's Golden State Warriors in the 2016 NBA Finals. Then with the Lakers in the bubble, LeBron would yet again climb the mountain, winning his four finals MVP in four tries. LeBron would also bring some below-average teams all the way to the NBA Finals, like the 2018 and 2007 Cavalier teams. For this, LeBron ranks top three in the best playoff performers in NBA history. Number two, Bill Russell. Riding out the list for Bill Russell's championships feels surreal every time. 11 NBA championships, including a run of eight in a row from 1959 to 1966 is simply extraordinary. Even if the league wasn't as talented as 
method in the 1960s as it is today, being able to stay mentally focused enough even though you had just won the previous seven titles is truly astounding. As a fair number of these matchups were against Wilt Chamberlain, another all-time great center, who in one season averaged 50 points and scored 100 points in a single game. Bill Russell was widely known as one of the greatest defensive players in the history of the game. He won 64.8% of his playoff games he appeared in and was 11-1 in the NBA Finals. All NBA fans, not just ones that root for the Celtics, will respect him for the way he played and what he did for the game. Number 1. Michael Jordan Michael Jordan made it to the NBA playoffs with the Chicago Bulls every season after his rookie year. He won 66.5% of his postseason games, giving him the best individual record of any player in NBA history. Jordan tore through teams in the playoffs as he was sensational during the regular season but upped it to another level in the postseason. MJ's 33.4 points per game is an NBA record for the highest career average by any player in playoff history. He played in six NBA finals and won all six of them, while being named the finals MVP every time. Not only that, but Jordan holds the record for the most points in a single playoff game with a 63-point performance against Larry Bird and the Boston Celtics at the Boston Garden. After that game, Bird suggested that Jordan was just God disguised as Michael Jordan. Given this truly ridiculous resume, if there are an all-time NBA playoffs MVP award, I think it would be fair to hand it to Michael Jordan. Want to hear more about individual players? Watch this video on the best individual seasons of all time next.